सो हाई एवरी वन वेलकम बैक आई होप यू आर डूइंग रियली फाइन एंड टूडे आई हैव विथ मी अ वेरी स्पेशल पर्सन एंड इट वॉज रियली प्लेजर दैट यू हैव कम टू शेयर सम वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग्स ऑन दिस चैनल फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल थैंक यू फॉर लेट यू कम इन योर चैनल हाई एवरी वन दिस इज अंशु रंजन फ्रॉम द डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ केमिकल इंजीनियरिंग ऑफ पैच टू के ट्वेंटी वन फ्रॉम वी आई टी सी धनबाद सो अंशु प्लीज टेल एस अबाउट यूर रिसेंट अचीवमेंट्स as it was an off campus opportunity uh, the application came in an unstop and i filled the application form all the process and procedures were done in the unstop itself and after clearing an online assessment round there was an interview round and after clearing all these i got an opportunity to uh, to have an internship in the reliance industries and after uh, two months completing my internship in the recent week last week i got uh, Full time offer from the Reliance Industries. So it was an off campus uh, oh, yes. application process. So during the short listing of the process, did college like the IT in the did it matter uh, for your resume short listing? I think yes, uh, somewhere because the IT industry being one of the prestigious institutes of India, the name and the brand the uh, IT industry holds helps in the short listing of the resume. so it was a and so it was a two month uh, internship paid internship and after that it got converted into a full time offer yes so during a two month paid internship how was your experience and how did it got converted okay uh, it was from the june 10 to august 2 and it had been a great opportunity for me to witness all the work cultures of the reliance there itself making relations with the gds uh, production managers and my friends and colleagues there it helped me grow professionally as well as um, the develop my skills in better way and before getting the ppo was there a short uh, presentation something regarding that uh, the there was a criteria in between that there will be a mid semester presentation and after the mid semester presentation there was a final presentation on the last week of our internship and a document uh, where the yes. was done yeah. document verification was done and if someone has active backlog or passive backlog and cgpa so please throw some light and wants to work in the reliance industry uh, so is it possible no backlogs are very much not allowable because the the reliance industry being one of the prestigious companies do not allow the backlog students to appear for the online assessment round itself so it from my recommendation it should be maintained as much as high cgp you can okay now coming to the cgp as we have talked mm-hmm. so what was your cgp and your 10 to 12 marks uh, since you landed the uh, pre placement offer so that the audience watching there can get a rough sketch of how to go about the cgp and the marks uh, yes so uh, my cgp at till fifth sem it was 8.8 around and in 10th i got 90% and in 12th 91% by csc board and decent communication skill and technical knowledge also you have or uh, it is very much required that you must have a good communication skill and technical knowledge is too applicable so guys if you are watching maintain your cgp as high as possible no active no passive backlogs and communication skill technical knowledge mm. uh, if you are targeting big industries like reliance and for off campus Uh, now one of the important thing is like what was the stipend offer during internship and do, uh, when it got converted into the full time offer what was the CC, uh, ctc offer oh uh, yes the internship during my internship uh, the government institutes and nids got the stipend of 30000 per month and it was for 2 months so it's 60k and for the iitn students uh, it was 40k per month and the ctc offered after getting a full time role it was 7.5 lakhs per annum uh, in the first year itself and after it will be increasing and if any chemical engineer is watching this video and he wants to know that which all subject should he focus on to get a full time offer at reliance so what would you suggest him like if uh, there, yes being a chemical engineering student your oil and refinery sector is one of the dream for the students to join itself so from my side mass transfer operations heat transfer operations and fluid mechanics must be the important subjects especially the distillation part and in fluid mechanics you know it very well the pump is very important 
okay now this question might be a bit controversial like uh, student ask like how to improve their communication skill like uh, should they join more than two clubs like this is regarding clubs so what clubs have you joined and regarding the communication uh, for the betterment of yourself or in the development you can join clubs there is nothing else if you can manage your time as well you, you are forth come to join the clubs or else study on your own and practice your hard work there is nothing any boundary for it your club uh, my club i have been a part of an ngo prayas india okay. and and i have been participating in the uh, small small events of very various clubs okay choose one and show clubs are no clubs think about it and then choose like does it really uh, matter it depends on the quality of a student if we can manage yeah the boundaries of the club as well as the education background there is no limit we can join okay i hope you have got the answer and the audience watching and now uh, one of the thing is like is there any advice you would like to give the juniors who is watching Uh, and who's targeting for Reliance industry? Any advice like CDP or not? Uh, it doesn't matter if you target Reliance or any other company. It uh, the matters is that you have to focus on your communication skills. So you maintain as much as a high CDP you can because it helps in the shortlisting of your resume. And third, have a good technical knowledge. Okay. I hope guys you have got all the answers that Anshu has told. He is a very bright student. He has told his CGPA ten twelve marks. Landed a PPO in Reliance industry, chemical engineer and Reliance industry. You can see the connection. Reliance is one of the most sought after industry for chemical engineers. So that Anshu Ranjan from chemical engineering final year BIT Sindhi. I hope you have found the video useful. And if you have found it useful. You can like it, and I'm sure it was really a pleasure that you have come to share the clips and share the video, guys. Thank you. So watch till the very end. Take care. Bye bye. Have a nice day.